I'm back. We're back vlogging. I know it's been a little bit over a month. Um, I took an impromptu break again because one, I wasn't really doing much other than getting ready for my move and two, work just got kind of hectic and so I was focusing solely on my move and on work and it just so happened that in the four months, three or four months that I've had my YouTube channel, I did the most in this month than I've that I didn't vlog, than I've done for the entire time I've had my channel, ironically. But that just means that I needed to enjoy the moment and enjoy the moments that I was in and not be videotaping them. But that's all coming to a cease because this is a moving vlog. We are moving, guys. It is happening. I've been talking about it for literally months like if it wasn't on YouTube it was on Instagram it was in real life I've been talking about it since I think the day I moved in that I was moving out so on um, Friday the 11th I'm officially moving to Dallas Texas and I'm so freaking excited today is Sunday June 6th and I just got home about two or three hours ago we had a going away dinner for me today um, it was just something small with my parents and my fam, or yeah, my, my parents and my friend, no, my parents and my family. Um, I've been able to see some of my friends in the past few weeks and I've been going out more than I did the whole time that I was here. I have two more like going away dinners that I'm going to go to with just my friends this week, but we have a lot of packing to do. So I'm just going to catch you guys up. Um, so in the midst of, since April, I got promoted, I got promoted, um, at my job, which is awesome. And I bought a new car. Um, I will, you guys will, when we get on the road, um, later this week, you'll see, um, you'll see that I actually need to buy a car mount. That's something else I need to get while I'm on Amazon. I'm currently placing a whole bunch of orders. So just to catch you guys up Friday, this past Friday, um, my new couch came in, my rug for the living room, and my new bed sheets came in. So we have that. Every Almost every other large piece of furniture, I waited too late to order it. And so I can't order it until I get there. So like my bed frame, my desk, my desk chairs, my island chairs, um, my carpet that's gonna go in my bedroom um that's pretty much it it's like the oh my uh my entertainment like tv thing that goes in the living room and my um my nightstands so um as you guys know we went to dallas over a little bit over a month ago to find a place for me to live and i didn't vlog this place and I actually did I vlogged the whole time and never ended up editing it putting it together nothing so I'm just watching Netflix and I am cleaning but I did want to start this moving vlog off today um yeah I need to take my hair is like oh yeah I took my hair out my weave out and this is just like my natural hair we're working on these curls coming back in but um my hair is a lot healthier and thicker than it was this time last year so that's what we love um but this ponytail is pulling my brains out hey girlfriend don't mind the way i look blew my hair out this morning so i get to slick it down a little bit smoother um i today's june 8th it's tuesday i am taking a break from work i've got to run to starbucks because i'm about to fall asleep and also I need gas <laughs> i'm going to dinner tonight um with one of my good girlfriends from high school she's one of my best friends and so we're going to dinner tonight so i need to get gas before because i have to leave as soon as i'm done with work um but i got some packages from amazon as you guys know we're moving on friday and so we're up in the most random places i have laundry like there's just there's there's things everywhere i'm waiting on one more amazon package and um that should come 
I thought I was 10 stops away right after this package told me he was 10 stops away so should be here soon and I just wanted to go through it with you guys and show you guys what I got okay so in this first box I got a drying mat um it's just black I'm sure everything in my I'm trying to incorporate more color in my apartment so not everything will be black or gray but this definitely will be because my utensils are gray I mean my utensils are black my like my cutlery is black my place plates cups all that are white i'm actually ordering a black set too so and then my uh my like drying rack is white and i hate it it's ugly and i'm gonna get a black one but it was 50 dollars so i'm just like we can wait on that so i got this um this is what it looks like this is seven dollars i got this adjustable cell phone stand I've really been wanting one of these. This was also fairly cheap. I think it was like not even ten dollars, maybe nine dollars, eight dollars. Ooh, this plate, like the bottom part of it, it's heavy. This would be better for Instagram stories instead of because when I put my phone up, like when I prop it up against something sometimes the sound messes up just put this together right fast just perfect just like that i'm gonna record an instagram story after this i just got the piva shower curtain liner and it came with hooks and this is the one that goes inside of the shower and then i got this barossa waffle weave fabric shower curtain i like these the best they're easy to throw in the wash um if they when it's time to clean them i think this was 15 dollars. this is 15 dollars. i got it in white and this was 17 dollars. i think Here are the shower hooks these were like five dollars yeah it's just like the regular like beaded i've had i get these are like the ones i get all the time the style in my bathroom right now it's serious actually and then i got um this is like shelf liner probably should have got some more i wish i got an extra one last but not least in this order are my utensils part of the reason why i took all this stuff out is because i'm very strategic in the way my stuff's packed I think these were $25. There's all different kinds you can get for all different prices, but I wasn't trying to pay an arm and a leg for them. I'm gonna just take, I think it's a set of, yeah, it's a set of four. So I'm gonna just take one fork out. Look how freaking nice. So yeah, set of four of these, super nice. Good morning. This is my last full day in Nashville. Um, I'm currently making me some coffee right now, which I probably shouldn't be using my mom's white mugs. She says they stain, but I need the aesthetic <laughs> um, to keep me calm. So it's 9.30 Thursday, June 10th. Today is my, one of my cousin's birthdays, and... I am still in shambles. Um, I had to take off today because yesterday, like, you know when you're mentally exhausted? That was yesterday for me. And so I had to take today off so that I could get everything that needed to be done for the move done and situated. So, so mainly everything is packed up down here except the stuff that I use in the kitchen. So... I just made myself some coffee as you can see the entire literally like I said everything down here is packed except um which let me get my vacuum cleaner out of here because I forget it we have to get my room done because it is has the most stuff right so I have I put it oh I have another package from Amazon coming today. There's some essentials that we're gonna need, but I don't have 
like readily available. Good morning. It is Friday, June eleventh, and we're moving. Today's the day we're moving to Texas. Um, the truck's loaded up. We have to load up my car. We have to load up my car. It's two fifteen in the morning. I went to sleep for about, I went to sleep at like 10.30 until 1 o'clock for sure. And then after 1, I just kept waking up. So, uh, I'm very tired. Um, but right now, I'm just getting ready and then we're going to be out. And then I'm packing the car up and then we're going to be out. So, I'll check back in with you guys when we get in the car. Okay, so we've left Nashville. We are, do you start the car again? Mm -hmm. We are close to Memphis. I think we're a few exits away from my grandparents' uh, farm, actually. But we're making progress. It's 618. Oh. And actually, I started driving, but the rain got to be a little bit too intense for me. And so, mom had to take over. With my mom, say hi. Hey, with my mom, um, the truck, moving trucks behind us, and Jake's this is brat. We're on the move. Next stop, Arkansas. We made it. This is my apartment. I'm just trying to make sure my address isn't showing anywhere. Um, this is my apartment. I'm not gonna do a full apartment tour, but I am going to do like bits and pieces. So like as I continue to decorate rooms um and i'm rocking back and forth because my back hurts but as i continue to decorate rooms i organize them i'll show them of course i have a lot of furniture that's not here yet and won't be here for a few weeks right now i'm just you know unpacking still moving things up and i'm trying to unpack as we go i did want to show you guys my dishes that my parents got me for my birthday my birthday's not until july but my parents went ahead and got me this um uh, dining set I needed a new one really bad my old one was just like pieces thrown together this one's a full set serves six people and it's all white exactly what I wanted my mom has one too and when she got it in when I was in high school I knew I wanted one I also have a black version this is from Macy's but I have a black version of dishes in my Amazon cart so I'm gonna have two sets I know that's excessive for someone that just moved to a new city and barely knows people, just has a few friends here, but you know, gotta coordinate. So I'm gonna just show you what it looks like on the box. This is what it looks like. It's inspiration by Denmark. Denmark is a really good um, diningware set that Macy sells. I'm just gonna finish unpacking and I'll see you guys in a little bit. We're getting in and out for dinner, so I'll be back on by then, hopefully. If not, me and my mom will just, we're gonna knock out because her and I are so tired. We've been up since two this morning. I needed groceries and I needed some more um, like organizing stuff. Just some more, some more, some more, right? So this is all the stuff that we got. All these bags. Mom and I have been going since, we've been up since 5.15 this morning. We had to take my cousins. They came and helped me to the airport. And then we took our U-Haul back and then we came back and started on this and then realized that like we need more stuff and so it just made more sense to get up and go get all the stuff first we went to we went to walmart with we dollar tree don't sleep on dollar tree okay dollar tree slaps i can spend a bag in dollar tree like i got these champagne flutes a dollar tree a dollar i got eight of them that was i got those back home but don't sleep don't sleep on dollar tree and then we went to home goods and then we went to whole foods and then we went to kroger yeah okay remember i told y'all don't sleep on the dollar store got these tongues or the dollar tree these tongs look at these gold baskets okay 
Okay. There we go. Look at how chic. Okay. And then got this armor all stuff for my car, which I'm going to go take right outside. I always pick up some of these Cascade Platinums. I think four come in here. Huh, two. Two come in here. And then I just keep them. Uh, batteries, some more liner. Remember, I didn't get to that. The name brand, we're known draft, told you guys, name brand stuff. We got these microfiber towels. You get four in a pack. So we got two of these. I watched this house cleaner on TikTok, and she said the best way to clean any of your mirrors is with a microfiber towel. And then I got this um, oven mitt because um, for whatever reason, I don't have one. And then I got another little doohickey. Where's like the silicone thing at? This bag, got some of these organizational trays. Some are gonna go in the kitchen and then some are gonna go in my bathroom. My mom being the demonstrator. We got this little doohickey that you get stuff out of the oven with. And then we got some Dove soap. And then, oh, this door hanger. Like, great stuff, $34, no, $32. I got 32 things. Don't sleep on the Dollar Tree. Okay, so I have done some more, just a little bit, um, since I last checked in with you guys. I've washed so many dishes. Good morning, friends. It's about 10.52. You already know I'm looking like who did it in all of the why. Um, I needed to take a break from working. I was getting a little overwhelmed. And I'm getting my living room TV mounted today um, in a few hours. And I just want everything in the living room to be out of the person's way. I just did a task rabbit. But I just want everything to be out of the person's way so that... Um, they don't step on anything, they don't trip over anything, um, or anything like that. Okay, so I'm just gonna finish picking up and I will come back on and show you guys what the living room and all that looks like once the TV's been mounted. And then I think I'm gonna end this vlog tomorrow morning on my way to way back from bringing, taking my mom to the airport. Um, she leaves at like, I think her flight leaves like 8.45, so I'm gonna take her. My mom likes to be at the airport two hours early. <laughs> so I'm gonna take her to the airport. Um, I wanna say like, six thirty is when uh, we'll probably leave and then come back because I don't have to start working until nine, but because I'm gonna be up so early, I'm gonna go ahead and try to work out. So I'm gonna get up and put on my workout clothes and then take her to the air and take her to the airport. Um, and because I'll, I'll have two hours to kill, stop by Starbucks, get a, like an espresso and um, work out. Okay, excuse the mess, it's very messy in the house right now, but I just got back from taking my mom to the airport she's gone <clears throat> she's on her way back to nashville now and um i'm sad i'm gonna miss my mom it's different because i've been living with my parents for the last nine months and we all knew that this day was gonna come that like i moved out and stuff but like just didn't think it would be this sad but i'm gonna miss her i know i can see her go home whenever I want but still I went to Starbucks 
the one by my house is I'm probably never going back to that one again. No. Um, my drink was good, but the Starbucks was no. I'm about to put my tennis shoes on and then I'm going to go work out. I need to clean up when I get back. I need to clean up when I get back. I don't have plans to go anywhere. Um, unless my best friend gets back in town, then I'll go see her. Um, but other than that, I'm going to stay home and clean and cook dinner and um, and get some of these boxes out of here. They're making fun of me at work. They were like, why are you so boxes? I have an hour and a half. Wish me luck. Okay, so I'm back. I did go to the gym for about 10 minutes. 10, 15 minutes, but I started to get lightheaded and I don't play that. The last time I went to the gym, super duper lightheaded like that, I was in living in Louisville and um, I literally had to go get McDonald's that was down the street just so that I could throw up. Like, I don't, I hate being lightheaded. I try to work out um, without eating at least like once a quarter, never works. I don't think I told you guys what day it is. It's June 16th and it's almost 8 o'clock and I was supposed to have a niece yesterday. I just texted her dad, which is my nephew. I just texted him to see if she had her, his girlfriend. So I'm waiting on that text back. I called my sister, but I feel like she's still asleep. Last night, my mom and I went to Taco Joint. It's down the street from my house. It is so good if you've ever lived in louisville and gone to dang it i forget the name it was on the top of my head <clears throat> tumbleweed their queso Tumbles, tumbleweed's queso is so freaking good well tex tex taco joint is just like it but 10 times better it's spicy it's so good we got the fajita tacos i will say they weren't seasoned enough for me but other than that they were good Hey vlog, so I just realized I never ended off the vlog. Like I said, I was going to when I dropped my mom off or the day before I dropped my mom off to the airport. I said I was gonna end the vlog that day and I forgot, so I'm gonna end it here. But I just wanted to kind of give you an update. I am still unloading boxes and cleaning. Still don't have my bed frame. It should be here tomorrow. Said it was gonna be here today, but it should be here tomorrow. I tracked it and it's in Dallas. So yeah, this is where I'm ending it. This is officially the end of my moving vlog. There's gonna be so many more vlogs a part of this series. Obviously, I'm gonna take you guys around. I think my kitchen will be the first place that I show you guys. Um, just the things that I bought, um, my storage things, things like that. So as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell your friend to tell your friend to tell their neighbor to come be a part of the girlfriends. I'll see you guys on my next one. Oh,